This is an introduction by Curtis Simpson to heart rhythm meditation. Heart rhythm meditation begins with the posture. Start by sitting up in a chair, upright, feet flat on the floor. Make sure your spine is straight, that your head sits levelly on your shoulders, neither looking down nor looking up, straight ahead. This posture produces immediate calm and peacefulness, tolerance and accommodation of others, and an attitude of sympathy and helpfulness. This is called the royal posture because we sit in the chair like a pharaoh. It's also called the monolithic position. You want your feet to be solid, grounded on the floor, and then you want to be still in this position, monolithic. You're comfortable, you're stable. Your spine is a superconductor that will radiate the energy of your heart into the space around you, like an antenna. Your posture is majestic. Your shoulders are back and down. You're not holding any tension there, but you want to do this. Make sure that your chest is open, chest area. Now notice your normal breathing. Do you hold your breath at the top of the inhale or maybe at the bottom of the exhale? Do you breathe shallowly? Notice the length of your breath. Notice the depth or the volume of air moved. What's the direction of your breath? Are you breathing through the nose or through the mouth? Sitting still, the only motion you'll notice in your body is your breath and your heartbeat. Breath is easier to notice. Notice the inhale and the exhale. Notice the turnaround between the two. Breathe through your nose, in and out through your nose. Think of the earth spreading out below you. Feel rooted in it, part of it, adopting its steady stability. The first intervention in heart rhythm meditation is the full exhale. At the end of your next exhale, Exhale two or three seconds longer than you normally would. Squeeze out as much air as you can at the end of your exhale. That's where we get that stagnant air that we tend to hold on to. We want to push all the air that's hiding in the depths of our lungs out. Then immediately let go at the end of that exhale and feel your belly filling like a balloon with the rush of air and energy. Continue to emphasize the exhale on the next few breath cycles, exhaling as deeply and completely as possible. Feel your belt area actually go in as you squeeze with your abdominal muscles that last few seconds of air. By extending our exhale like this, this will allow us to inhale more completely, to take in more breath. And that's the second intervention here, is to increase your inhales. As you inhale from the beginning of the exhale, as your belly begins to fill on the inhale, You'll feel the belly fill, and then when the belly's full, then the chest will rise for the last few seconds of the inhale. Try to stretch that as 
as much as you can, but don't strain. Inhale as completely as possible and then release it and fall into the exhale. This is the full breath. The next intervention is to hold your breath at the top of the next inhale. Hold your breath as long as you comfortably can and listen and feel inside for the sensation of your heartbeat in your chest. Repeat this on the next couple of inhales, holding at the top of the inhale and listening and feeling inside your chest area for your heartbeat, your physical heart. And now I also recommend that you find a pulse point. Take your two fingers from one hand and place it on the wrist or the throat on your pulse area and make sure you have a good pulse and use that along with the feeling of your heart beating in your chest. We want to use this pulse now to count. On the next exhale now, count a certain number of beats, say six or eight, and whatever you exhale to, then make the inhale the same. So if you exhale to a count of six, inhale to a count of six. This makes your breath even, even length, inhale and exhale. Count with your pulse, an equal number of pulses on the inhale and the exhale. If you can do six comfortably, try to stretch that to eight. You don't want to strain, but you do want to challenge yourself with the breath. And now continue to breathe in this way. Complete inhale and exhale, that's the full breath. This is a conscious breath. It's a balanced breath. And it's a rhythmic breath. Now you can drop any particular hold and just continue to breathe in this way. Full, conscious, rhythmic breathing. Breathing out, let your breath sink down deeply. Keep thinking of sending your breath into your stomach area. And this is home base for heart rhythm meditation. Full conscious rhythmic breathing with awareness of pulse and heartbeat. Now enjoy some breath cycles, breathing in this way. You're breathing in and out through the nose, silently, a full exhale and inhale with no pause.